It should be back to normal tomorrow at a Broward County High School after quite a scare today. A student caught with a knife. CBS 4's Carrie Cott is live, uh, live at Piper High School in Sunrise where this happened. Carrie? Elliot, any mention of a student on campus with a weapon strikes fear into the hearts of parents, students, and school staff. That's why news today here at Piper High School of a code red lockdown, a student injured, another student with a knife made headlines, lots of news coverage. It also prompted questions of when will these events stop happening. This cell phone video from a Piper High School student captured part of the aftermath of Monday's incident. A student in a red shirt and red shoes is taken into custody after some sort of altercation with another student. Police say the student arrested brought a knife to school and got into a fight with another student. The victim suffered an injury to a finger. The altercation led to a four long lockdown on campus, and Sunrise Police say the student with the knife ran and hid after the incident. He was arrested a short time later. We're told he's being booked on juvenile charges. Police say it could include a charge of aggravated battery. It's got to stop. It has to stop someday. I just feel like it was really, if that's what really happened, it was really unnecessary, and I wish this wouldn't ever happen because it took a lot from the day. Students say the code red and news of the knife on campus put them on edge. Meanwhile, parents received this phone call from the school district about the code red. We are on code red and will remain on a code red lockdown until the investigation is completed. I want to assure you that all district safety protocols and precautions are being followed. 10th grader Ray Prince says he knows the student who was taken into custody. Kind of a bad kid, you know, but you know, he, on his Instagram and stuff, he posts a lot of guns, a lot of violence. It could have been a lot worse. I reached out to Broward County Schools today. I wanted to know if the student who was arrested has ever made threats against the school before or been a problem. They told me that due to privacy laws, they cannot discuss that. The district did tell me that all safety and security protocols were followed, and they are cooperating with the law enforcement investigation. Live in Sunrise, Kerry Codd, CBS 4 News tonight.